Yeah, there's, there's some handshaking going on in the background right now. Oh, oh Yo, AFW with come. the sleeveless hoodie tech in the background. That's a you. Yeah, big big fan of the sleeveless hoodie tech. There, we got Fabio sitting down. Which means we get Ness or Fox. Probably Falco. Falco. Yeah, Falco. He's been playing, uh, at least in friendly ah! lately, he's been playing Falco and uh, and Marth. Big fan of Marth. I know Marth has been making a recent resurgence, uh, so here for it. But we'll see how well it manages against Eagle. They Eagle start on PT. Stadium. I'm gonna start Stadium here. Stop the battle. That moving groove to the music. Pokemon Trainer. Yeah, Fal leading off with the Falco is uh, Fabio. Falco. So this is a pretty uh, part and parcel matchup. Spacey versus uh, Pokemons. You gotta see which of the Mons are on point for Eagle tonight. Sometimes the Squirtle will be cooking. Yeah. Other times it's the Charizard. I was about to say, work. not really the Ivy so much. We see him utilize the other two a lot more effectively. But if there is a time for their Ivy sort of pop off, it's gonna be with Falco. Because Falco off stage does not want to have to deal with Ivy sort buttons. Yeah. At the ledge, though, Eagle got to get back on and able to gain control here. Not enough time to swap, though, to, uh, to put on the pressure that I just throw 10 off stage. But now comes the, the frog, the toad, whatever he is. Well, he's an Ivysaur. Heck, he is. He is. You know what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I really got the shield out in time to block the up smash. All right, finally forcing to the ledge on his own terms. Like the Ivysaur's in position to make it happen. Uh -oh. That was an up B. He was literally right there. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, the tunnel vision for going for the one thing and then uh -oh. the execution. But hey, Ivysaur down there comes in when you need it. Let's go the flag of Japan. It is a huge hitbox. But that's part of the reason why it's so good for this particular matchup. Oh, All good right. switch. Yeah, the swap can get him out of that situation. Got to get out of this one, though. Oh, The weight of Charizard not going to get it done. All right, back onto the Squirtle. The Falco at a low percent. This is up the Squirtle's opportunity to shine. If he's able to get the hit, but swapping out to the Ivysaur. And with the Ivysaur, is gone. Back to the Charizard. Yo, he was just gone, gone. And the camera didn't even bother to follow Eagle. Camera's like, I can't show this. The fact that the trainer is on the far oh left god. is actually ruining this. Oh god. Oh, not ruin. oh god. Oh, what a mess. Things, things were looking really good there for Eagle at the beginning, and then it just all fell apart. I, I'm not going to lie. I'm still kind of upset that the camera kept on cutting to the trainer with every swap. <laughs> and because of that, we just didn't see what Fabio was doing. Straight up, I don't even know if Eagle could see the ledge on how to return. Oh, that's rough. Yeah. Got to deal with that, though. All right, back to stadium, though. I think the stadium pick is fine and dandy. You got to... The trainer will not move. <laughs> you just got to play it. I guess if you have a choice in the matter, get your ass handed to you on the other stage, uh, side of the stage. <laughs> I feel like that's that of Eagle's control. <laughs> Only a smidge, though. All right. Able to get the first hit. But not able to get any follow-up of it, and now Fabio gonna get the, the combo going. Yeah, the fact that Fabio has the presence of mind to make sure that he's at the edge of platforms or at the edge of the stage, so that he doesn't have to deal with long squirrel combos, or hell, squirrel combos in general, is really good presence of mind for this matchup. Zygusaur is doing all the damage. We were talking about, uh, you know, the the Eagle Squirtle and the, and the Eagle Charizard, but this, so far, everything that Eagle has been able to do this set has come from the Ivy. Whenever we see Eagle on stream, and we do get a chance to see him on stream somewhat often, I feel like it's always one Mon is popping off that day. It, it is Ivysaur's time to shine tonight. And like I was saying earlier, if there were any matchup for it to, to be, this is a really good one to have Ivysaur in the pocket looking reliable. 
not only are the good combos like clearly there for Eagle, but there's not that big of a lack of uh, kill power when it comes to Ivy's so, well, Just gotta be mindful of your speed because it's not a very fast play. But that up smash is fast. Really good way for Eagle to even things up to the 2-2 count. All right, Squirtle gonna be able to put Fabio off stage here. Picking up on the roll off of Legend 2. Oh, I like that. Go for the short combo because you know that you can't cut this longer combos on Fabio. Reliable the Squirtle, damage though. a long way. Look at this. Squirtle popping off right now and able to trap him here at the ledge. Catches the jump in with a forward smash. Oh, he gave up stage control oh. for this. No, he didn't. <laughs> Charizard yeah, said, no, I didn't. I, I am the eraser. I've come to correct my test. Like the armor on fly decided to even things back up. Down tilt able to send him here at the ledge. He's gonna use the laser to keep him away. Oh. Trying to land. Keeping yes, things grounded really smart for me. Oh! I see what Fabio is trying to do there with the side beam, but just short, too short to get it. Now Eagle with a bit of a lead here. Oh, able to avoid these back airs. Oh! Oh! What is happening? We're going what is happening? <laughs> and all around. I Everything up to... <laughs> I understood everything up until the Charizard up and I'm like, no! <laughs> Stop armoring with the piece. <laughs> like, Fabio tried to get real cute with taking advantage of Fire Falco to occupy space near the ledge. And I appreciate the creativity. But it did lead to a very wonky situation. Back air, Razor Leaf should have been Rar Nair, but such is life. Keep that damage on. What's the down air? No follow up off of it, though. Yeah, in that kind of a situation, it's just a hard for who gets their spike. <laughs> the reflector broke up the grab. I mean, it is like a frame five, frame four option, something of that nature. But the grab already hit. That's hysterical. <laughs> like, grab interrupts tend to be really finicky in this game. What's the call? It's yeah. forward smash at the ledge. There was with that, like a tiny bit of dash back too. That was a yeah. really good reaction from me, and it's gonna bring us into game three. Hey, you know what, Pokemon Trainer? You're right. Everyone did do great. <laughs> this is a really well-balanced game from Eagle. The Ivasaur was doing nice, but then we saw some Squirtle combos. Charizard got us out of danger. That was just some good, clean Pokemon Trainer play that time. That's what we need to see from Eagle. Stock after stock, game after game, set after set. Because good, well-balanced play like that is what puts you in the same conversation of talking about notable trainers. All right, Fabio immediately starting off with some pressure, but puts himself towards the ledge here. See if Eagle's able to take advantage of that. Yeah, we're three for three on escaping Squirtle by going directly to the ledge, but we've seen Eagle like trying to close this gap, build up the percentage, and switch over to Ivysaur, and it's a game plan that's working. But well, it's working right now. Red, right now, look at this. How comes the Ivy at the ledge? He'll be just gonna get him out of that situation, but laser just to keep him in place. The laser does such a great job at locking down opponents due to the, how much hit stun it has. Back throw, not enough to do it yet, but threatening. Ooh, the spot dodge and then just falling straight down. Not really able to commit to a button, so he didn't want to mash something out. I like it. The up throw into the back here, just gonna get the damage. Down is yeah. big! Ivysaur down air does wonders. As good of decisions as Fabio has been making off stage. Also, these interrupts on up air look horrible. <laughs> <laughs> There's some very ugly looking interactions in this game. Like what I was gonna say is that Fabio's making good decisions on stage and off stage, but Falco is just not that fast. Like Fire Falco, uh, like Falco Illusion. Like these take a little bit of time before they actually get going. So that's plenty of time for Eagle to put the punish in works. Oh, if not for that laser, oh. that was a cooked bird. 
Are able to take the stock, but sitting at 116 now on the dash attack from Charizard. Bad place for Fabio to be in, but Falco, a character that can rack up the damage real quick. And now with the lighter character spurted out, could potentially even uh, get a, a uh, early stock. But he's got to get the hit first in order to make that magic happen. Squirtlebot is just so good at asserting the game state of being at the ledge. All the width oh. of the grab would have been curtains. How wonderful this was. Oh. He's gonna send the resolute back. Uh oh, doesn't have the jump, gonna be forced to up B here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Trying really to get sneaky well with the angle. Down tilt forced a really yucky situation for Fabio, and now unless stop. I think Fabio also tried to do something cute with the angle to avoid the down B, like the stall up against the side, but he didn't have the. Uh, the height in order to make that work and get back to the ledge. Alright, at the ledge here. Fabio can bring this back. Oh, if he got that fair, that would have done it, but... Down smash, still not enough to do the job against Charizard. He needs to jump though with the laser, but... The magnets! Oh, How do they work? Good lord! That must have been just ever so slightly away from not actually connecting. Oh, the runoff fair. Oh. All right, able to get the stock. A lot more even of a game right now than it was five seconds ago. Yup, really good play has brought us to the last stock situation. Oh, click from Squirtle! He oh, has one? Yes. <laughs> Man, it, man, it's just save Eagle's base I've in there. I've never seen that before. What the fuck? Yeah, man. <laughs> you want to know oh. something? It led to the victory for Eagle. It's a 2-1 victory oh, for Fabio. Oh, Squirtle Walkling. What? 